Shingles, what you need to know. Ruth is 67 years old with acute pain in her neck and shoulder. She has shingles. Ruth's shingles caused so much pain, she couldn't bear to put on her clothes or have sheets touch her skin. Her shingle symptoms lasted for several months. George had it easier. Shingles only made him feel sick for a few days. He felt a little itchy for a while, but he was back to his old self in a few weeks. What is shingles? Shingles is a disease that affects your nerves. It is caused by the same virus as chickenpox. After you recover from chickenpox, the virus stays in your body. The virus could become active again and cause shingles. About one in three people will get shingles. Your risk increases as you age. About half of all shingles cases are in adults age 60 or older. Ruth and George both experienced some common symptoms of shingles, such as a rash with fluid-filled blisters on one side of the body. Other symptoms include burning shooting pain, tingling, itching, numbness of the skin, chills, fever, headache, and an upset stomach. Even when the rash disappears, the pain can remain long-term. For some people, the symptoms of shingles are mild. They might just have some itching. For others, shingles can cause intense pain that can be felt from the gentlest touch or breeze. After the shingles rash goes away, some people may be left with ongoing or long-term pain called postherpetic neuralgia, or PHN. This pain can cause depression, anxiety, sleeplessness, and weight loss. Talk with your doctor about medicines that may help with PHN pain. The chicken pox virus causes shingles. If you have had chicken pox, it is possible to develop shingles. Shingles is not contagious. You can't catch it from someone, but you can catch chicken pox from someone with shingles. To limit the spread, it's important to keep the rash covered. Don't touch or scratch it. Wash your hands often. If you think you might have shingles or notice blisters on your face, talk to your doctor as soon as possible. Most cases of shingles last three to five weeks. Most people get shingles only one time, but it is possible to have it more than once. Healthy adults age 50 and older should talk to their health care provider about getting the shingles vaccine. It's safe and easy, and the vaccine is an effective way to prevent shingles and PHN. People over age 50 should get the shingles vaccine, which is given in two doses. You should try to get the second dose of the vaccine between two and six months after the first dose. You can get the shingles vaccine at your doctor's office and at some pharmacies. Most health insurance plans will cover the cost. You should get the shingles vaccine if you've already had chicken pox, the chicken pox vaccine, or don't remember having had chicken pox. If you had shingles or received a different shingles vaccine, you should also get vaccinated. You should not get vaccinated if you have had an allergic reaction to the vaccine or if you currently have shingles. If you are sick and have a fever, you should usually wait until you recover to get the vaccine. So talk with your health care provider before getting vaccinated or if you have other health concerns. Here are some tips on how to cope with shingles. Get plenty of rest. Eat well-balanced meals and try simple exercises like stretching or walking. Check with your doctor before starting a new exercise routine. Avoid stress. It can make the pain worse. Do relaxing things to take your mind off your pain. Read or listen to music. Take an oatmeal bath or use calamine lotion. Share your feelings about your pain with family and friends. 
ask for their understanding. To learn more about shingles, visit www.nia.nih.gov.